So you might be experiencing very, very slow download speeds on your particular Mac. Now, this can happen for literally an unlimited amount of reasons, but the very first thing I'd recommend doing is actually making sure that your Wi-Fi connection is properly set up and you don't have any issues with your Wi-Fi. Pretty much for every single person, if you're in this type of situation, you can run into so many problems literally just within your particular phone or your particular Wi-Fi. So what I'd recommend doing is making your way over to your Wi-Fi connection settings, which are at the top, you know, basically the top portion right here with your Wi-Fi setting is. And what you're going to want to do here is right here where it says, you know, Wi-Fi or whatever, you want to make sure you're connected to the 5G version of your Wi-Fi, but you also want to make sure your 5G version of your Wi-Fi is good condition, you know, good quality, and you're close to the router. If you're very far from your router, if you're not using Ethernet, things like that can slow your specific, you know, Wi-Fi connection down. So just make sure you're connected to a good internet connection, make sure everything's good there. And probably for a lot of people, that's probably all the issues you're going to run into. Now, let's say you do that and that's not working. Another thing I'd recommend doing is going through and just double checking your specific, you know, what version of your, and double checking your, you know, the version of software that you're basically on. So in the top left corner, go and click on your Apple logo up here, go and click on system settings and or about this Mac. And you just want to go and take a look at which, you know, which particular version of software you're on. If you're on a very outdated version of Mac OS, you might be in a better situation if you just update your specific software. So what I'd recommend doing here is just going through, clicking on your specific Apple logo up here, going into system settings, and then pretty much clicking on general, clicking on software update, and pretty much just updating your phone. Like I said, when it's checking for updates and you actually go and install it, for a lot of people, all you're pretty much gonna have to do is just update your particular Mac, and that might end up fixing the problem too, and that might be all you have to do in these particular situations. If that still doesn't work, you can try going through and actually restarting your Mac. You can try connecting to a better Wi-Fi connection. If none of those things are working, I would guarantee you that you might have a little bit of a small issue on your Mac, and you can try actually going through and actually updating your Mac again, or seeing if you can wait until you know something fixes it in and of itself. That might be another thing you can try doing as well. So that pretty much covers it up. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.